Ten times someone other than Naruto saved the day. Despite being the hero of the series, Naruto is not the only person who has proven capable of saving the day. It is commonly accepted that in the Naruto universe, its title protagonist is obliged to save the day. More often than not, this phenomenon has been true, especially in the later arcs of the series where his power grew exponentially. However, other characters have displayed heroics just as intrepid as his own, willing to place their lives on the line and sometimes even sacrifice them for the greater good. Although not as powerful as the protagonist, they have proven to be just as heroic on occasion. 10. Sasuke saved Sakura Naruto from Dosu. Perhaps one of the most scarring, albeit admirable moments of Sasuke's early labors as a hero was when he staved off Dosu and his sound ninja allies. Since Team 7 was still recovering from a brush with Orochimaru, Rock Lee was their only line of defense against the malevolent Genin. After the Taijutsu expert's defeat, it seemed as if all hope was lost. However, Sasuke abruptly awoke from his slumber, activated his curse mark, and horrifically mangled Zaku's arm. Though the villain would survive, he would be forced to live with the injury during his battle against Shi. 9. Hiruzen saved everyone by crippling Orochimaru. The fight between Hiruzen Sarutobi and Orochimaru was one the former knew he could not ultimately win. His students Edo Tensei were too overwhelming for him to defeat on account of his old age. As a result, Sarutobi unleashed the forbidden Reaper Death Seal, attempting to guarantee mutually assured destruction. Though Orochimaru managed to avoid the Jutsu, he could not save his arms. As a result, he was no longer able to fight efficiently against the rest of the leaf, dashing his plans to destroy Kanoha once and for all. 8. Jiraiya saved Naruto from Kisame Itachi. The Akatsuki infiltrated the leaf with the intention of kidnapping Naruto. Applying an unusual amount of teamwork, Kisame and Itachi managed to avoid the Jonin who arrived to confront them and appeared before the Jinchuriki outside his hotel. Though Jiraiya was distracted, he quickly returned to the side of his student, foiling the villain's plans and forcing them to retreat. Sasuke also attempted to join the battle, only to be immediately defeated and humiliated by his older brother. Nonetheless, he bought the Sanin the time required to make his heroic intervention. 7. Sakura saved Kankuro from dying to poison. After a brutal encounter with Sasori, Kankuro was badly wounded and left for dead. Once the sand retrieved and escorted him to the hospital. The greatest medical minds were called to his attention, including Sakura of the Leaf. Though Sasori attacked with a poison that had no known antidote, her vast medical knowledge allowed her to save his life. It displayed a unique skill that neither Naruto nor Sasuke could match, providing one of the first instances of her usefulness in what would be a long and illustrious shinobi career. 6. Chio resurrected Gara. By the time that the heroes were able to retrieve Gara from the Akatsuki, it was already too late. With Shikaku extracted from his body, the Kazakage died an excruciating death that no amount of healing could remedy. However, Chio was determined not to let her leader pass on. Through sacrificing what remained of her life, she was able to resurrect the young man, enabling him to continue a career as the Sand Village's just and thoughtful leader. Were it not for her selflessness, the allied shinobi forces would be deprived of their charismatic figurehead. 5. Anoki saved everyone from Madara's meteors. Upon Madara Uchiha's resurrection, he promptly decimated much of the allied shinobi forces. To conclude his wrath, he summoned two gigantic meteors by which to destroy his enemies with a small cataclysm. It was the first true depiction of the villain's wrath. However, Anoki rushed to prevent them from colliding with the ground, using his jutsu to lighten the meteor's payload. In spite of his old age and with Gara's assistance, 
he managed to avoid what could have been the end of the united resistance effort. 4. Tsunade saved Jiraiya from being assassinated by Orochimaru. In a previous war, the stone village surrounded a mountainside and bombarded it with rocks, hoping to cave it in. Jiraiya was seriously wounded at the time, prompting Orochimaru to attempt his assassination as leaving him would make him prone to interrogation and because he could not be sufficiently carried. However, Tsunade refused to abandon her ally, willing to turn her wrath against the deviant San Nin if necessary. This was demonstrated to be a superb display of judgment, as the trio would soon find salvation. 3. Itachi prevented a world war. Though the Uchiha genocide was one of the most abhorrent actions of the entire anime, it was one that prevented even greater disasters. By putting his clan down, he prevented them from rising up against the Senju and causing more dire bloodshed. Moreover, the turmoil in the leaf would have attracted the attention of other villages that might attempt to capitalize on the situation. This would effectively have caused a world war that vastly eclipsed Itachi's actions and one that could have plunged the shinobi world into another era of darkness. 2. Hinata saved Naruto from pain. Though Naruto has most often been depicted saving Hinata such as through his fight against Tonori Atsutsuki, the converse has also occurred. This was most memorably demonstrated through Hyuga's intervention on his behalf during Pain's attack on the village. While Hinata may have been predictably decimated by Nagato, she purchased her beloved the time he needed to free himself of the chakra inhibiting rods that pinned him down. Though her actions left her badly wounded, it provided Naruto the opportunity to conclude the fight in victory and become the hero that she always perceived him to be. 1. Niji sacrificed himself for Naruto. As the fourth shinobi war neared its conclusion, the ferocity of the ghetto statue made itself known. With projectiles spewing indiscriminately in every direction. Only Niji's Byakugan was able to identify two spears intended to skewer Naruto. His response was clear and unhesitating, he cast his body in their path, sacrificing himself for the man he had once considered to be an incorrigible fool. Naruto gave Niji's passing all of the veneration and honor that he deserved, with his marriage to Hinata securing the continued greatness of the Hyuga clan. <laughs>